Yeah, welcome to Get Wrecked. Yeah. 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 The Get Good Extraordinaire episode, dude. Let's go, dude. Yeah, man. For so the we... minds that brought from the sick and twisted minds. <laughs> <laughs> the minds that brought you Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> from the sick and twisted minds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, fucking. Yeah, this is I, I, this drop in tomorrow, Monday. And then two days later, F2's dropping. Okay. So yeah. this is, yeah, I'm Amazing. pumped for it. So um, we plan on doing it. A while ago, and then it, t- it turns out it takes a while to make <laughs> to finish. Yeah, it takes a while to beat yeah. cancer. Yeah. <laughs> is that what, why you stopped doing it? Is because uh, you had cancer? You I let that were... get in the way of your creative <laughs> pursuits? Yeah. What a bitch. What a puss I mean, yeah, I will say so that is my yeah. biggest bra moment in my life. What? <laughs> it's getting cancer. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally what I said. The doctor's like, there seems to be a tumor on your testicle, on your right testicle. We need to operate soon. I'm like, Bruh moment. <laughs> Dude, I use those. <laughs> so. But yeah, because people are going to, because they, they watch the first step, and then they're going to see the second one, your hair is just gone. Yeah. yeah. So th- there's no, for the, the context. Two, the two main things uh, that changed on appearance-wise from episode mm. one and two is I lost all my hair and then got it back a little bit, mm. and, uh, and then, because I had cancer. Fellas, and then this is all he fucking. Yeah, it was about. so when he had it, it was so annoying. And me and Christoph have a purely professional relationship, so you're making fun of me right now. It's, it's fucking what the hell? Me, yeah, we're not actually friends. Really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, the, the sex stuff, the kissing, that's yeah, all just it's all no. just for the I show. Mean, we're ex lovers. And the other yeah. one is Joe stopped drinking, so he lost. A oh bunch my of, he god, way Joe be- lost a. He looks way better in episode two. He does look way better <laughs> after yeah. not drinking. For yeah. a while. When we made the title cards, he's like fat in the first. Title <laughs> yeah, no, he, <laughs> he, do- he does kind of fat. <laughs> he doesn't look good. Yeah, what yeah. a loser. <laughs> no, good for him though. I, yeah. made a, I made a point to stay fat for content. <laughs> <laughs> so every episode, yeah. don't worry, guys, I'm fat. Yeah. yeah. All right, because no, I have dedication. Yeah, you understand the craft. Yeah, cheese. I used to have a bit like that and then I killed myself. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> this is the, it was gonna to be it was gonna be me and Jake for a second just doing this, and then Chris Hoff was in town. <laughs> and I hope we could that made that. the whole podcast. It was Chris Hoff going. <laughs> 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 We're like, so yeah, and get good. There was you know the reason the, the writing that, process the, the, the really like took something. And I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> writing process more like fucking. Being, yeah, you just start masturbating. <laughs> Yeah, but that's kind of like the vibe I bring to set, you know. <laughs> yeah. It's really I'm sort of a uh, talk to him. You know what I mean? I'm I'm sort of like, you know what I mean? Like you have peanut butter, you have jelly, but you know I'm the bread. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, keep them together. Yeah, because you got one, you got brown goo, you got purple goo. <laughs> I'm brown goo. Yeah, you're brown goo. Peanut butter is Jake brown. Is, Jake yeah, is I would definitely call it peanut brown. butter. What bro? would you call it? Green, <laughs> is it really brown? <laughs> Wait, peanut butter? Yeah, yeah, it's brown. It's not. Are you oh, that colorblind? Yeah. I, oh I, my I, god, yeah. you do not think peanut butter is? Green. I thought it was like a dark forest green. Bro, you making shit up? I swear to God, you making shit up, bro? You're like, what? Oh, what color is the sky? Uh, seven. <laughs> <laughs> Goofy ass. <laughs> you sounded really Sandler there. <laughs> oh, seven. <laughs> oh, what color is the sky? <laughs> the sky gods. I hope we come at each other so much by the end of this. It's gonna be like we're not releasing it. I'm deleting, <laughs> yeah, I'm deleting the files. You, Jake's like, I'm deleting yeah. the files. Yeah. It's gonna be the one thing where we pull the mic away when we finally like really get into it. We're like, no, no, no I'm, I'm not even recording. Yeah, dude, that would be Joe. He would yeah. storm off in a hunt. I would not, yeah. dude. I was that's always gonna you. be Maybe friends with you guys. Maybe I am a homosexual. Maybe I am. No, 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 no. no I'm no, gay. What no, of it? What of it? So I suck penis. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm always gonna be friends with you guys. Yeah, till the day we kill you. Joe dies. Oh. You guys, you guys, <laughs> yeah. you guys almost like ended your friendship while filming. No, no, no. no yeah, yeah, yeah. No, when you were on the no. truck in episode four, you well, guys were getting mad. Was, I'm a method actor. And it, it was a complicated Joe was situation. Interfering and, with my method. Yeah, I was. was I was method? being a bit uh, um, laxadaisical. Yeah, a little nice. laxadaisical, and, and Christoph wasn't having it. We yeah. have it on camera. If you guys want to decide for yourself, <laughs> <laughs> we're not releasing it though. Yeah, that well, was a fun day though. That general, was a good day. Yeah, yeah that was a seven-hour shoot, and we got kicked out from parking lot to parking lot. Yeah, I think maybe it was just 
tensions were a little high. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. There was we had one wine bottle and I was holding it correctly, yeah, you, but Chris Upton see that I was it? holding it correctly. Right, this yeah. This is yeah, so immediate, it was episode no, this four. Is how we filming. actually we get conflict. kicked out of a parking lot because we have a really cool scene in yeah. it for. And then we go. <laughs> we only have one wine bottle and there's we just didn't want to have to go buy another one and we don't have a normal way to open it. Yeah. And the shit, we're like trying to like what wedge do do? it open. Do that again. We're trying to like, <laughs> uh, you don't have to open wine bottles. Yeah, yeah, no, go yeah, ahead. Like, <laughs> no, don't stop. Don't stop. <laughs> we're trying to open the wine. I didn't even Wait, do that. Wait, but they they didn't, uh, they haven't, we we're talking about episode four already, but I, if, there, if this is coming out before the, the, it's the totally show. fine. Yeah, it's that's yeah, but four. let's start at the beginning. Let's start. Yeah. Let's oh, you, you want to keep this chronological? Well, we, well, we just gotta say first. There's five episodes total. Yeah, four uh, more coming. Hour and a half of yeah. content coming your way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, including episode one. Yes. So like an hour, but the it's hour ten. Yeah, yeah. Whatever, well, hour Why do you still nitpick everything Jake it's says? The fucking worst. It's a Why? miracle we got this done with this <laughs> kind of like. This kind of prima donna type Having attitude. I'm trying to talk to these while we edit. Has it been miserable? I'm trying know, to talk to I the know. get gooders, bro. And you know it hasn't been miserable. Bro. You love me. What's <laughs> up, get gooders? What's yeah. up, get gooders? Is that what you're calling them? <laughs> yeah, it's the, the get gooders, dude. Yeah, I like get gooders. Well, how about the go getters, dude? <laughs> yeah. What about the go getter gooders? <laughs> oh man, that's that's mm -hmm. good. All right, so F two. So, so yeah, I think we should two. start why it took a year for the in between. Well, episodes. Joe had cancer, which he wouldn't again. He would not shut up about. Oh my god. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. This is my impression of Joe having cancer. You guys are looking bad right now. You're making fun of someone. So <laughs> just saying, I'm going to let you. You don't have it anymore. Yes, I do. Not well, you've not had it long enough to I get have fucking an appointment. I <laughs> have an appointment with fucking Dr. Machado on the 9th. So yeah. maybe it'll come back and I you'll feel so bad well, about this podcast. Fingers crossed. Fingers <laughs> 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 um, I'll say it. Yeah. yeah. I hope you do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care that you lost your yeah. testicle. I don't care that you broke <laughs> no, dude. I mean, we were all so. <laughs> I love that meme. I'm serious. Like for that year that you had cancer, I was genuinely really upset for about a week, and then <laughs> after that, it was annoying. Oh, okay. Well, uh... <laughs> I was, I, I well, was worried. Uh, I was well, upset, but you were really chill about it. You well, were like, dude, like 95 percent success rate will be good. Yeah. And you were just like, this is gonna suck. Yeah. Well, well was that, that was that was the. The ninety five percent success rate did help help me a little bit at the beginning, but I kept saying that I just had to tell myself that over the course of the year. Yeah, what sucks about yours was that testicle cancer. They usually just take it out, and that's it. Yeah, that's like sixty percent of people. Yeah, and then uh, there was f well, I, I, to bring it to get good is we were editing episode one. Yeah, which was so much fun, and we all had a great time working on it. Yeah, that was and fun. Uh, but I did already have cancer at that point, but I just got the the testicle out, and then yeah. um. And then that was it, and I was chilling. And then while we were editing, I think we were finishing it up. I got the call to, uh, to fucking be like, yo, you got to do four rounds of chemo. Mm -hmm. And so I got that call from the doctor, went inside of Jake's, and was like, I was like, guys, I I have to do chemo. And I was like, all right. And then we pl press play, and then we'll watch Ross yeah, talk yeah, about yeah. eating shit or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I was like, all right, let's get it done, dude. Yeah. <laughs> the people want it. Yeah. And we then, but also, you moved to New York. Yeah. We had to write it. Yeah. You know, I think I was writing it while I was going through this stuff. And you were, then, you were, I, I, I remember like talking to you and you were like, dude, I want to write it. I was like, well, whenever you're ready, you're like, no, I'm fucking bored right now. I want to, I need to write. Like, yeah. I, I want to do this. Yeah. Yeah. It was a lot of fun. I mean, well, so yeah, let's, this, this is good. We'll go through the whole process. And so then episode yeah. one came out and, uh, uh, me and Kristoff uh, really liked it, but we didn't have any plans to do any more. Yeah. And then uh, it came out, and I think at first it was like just kind of sat there. And then I think we were on the vibe of like, well, we'll do it, but we definitely want to do it a little different for the rest of the season. Yeah, I had to like bring you guys in and be like, guys, come on. <laughs> <laughs> more episodes. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it, it, it definitely, uh, the, the two things that made me want to do more that were like, once I started getting ideas, it was number one, it was uh, seeing it do well on like shorts and like all the positive comments. Because genuinely, it's not that I thought it was bad, but with the internet, I assumed all the comments would be like, this is cringe. Yeah, YouTube comments, you typically expect the worst. Like, I was expecting to just get destroyed, like, just fucking whack. Yeah, this sucks. You're I trying you. too hard. Yeah. But it's literally like 500 comments. 99% there might be one that's yeah. like a critique but it's not like yeah. this sucks yeah. it's well, like we some also, guy who thinks he knows film like you could have done this yeah but, well cause that's my brain too is like there were obviously yeah. things about episode one that bothered me whether it be like you know certain acting moments or, or just like 
I mean, we just learned so much making yeah. more of it. Yeah. Just right. looking back on it, it's like, oh, if only we knew what we knew now. All so right. it's like, I just assumed all the comments would be all of my critiques, but yes. all the comments were like, this is great. You know, when is there, there more? And it, yeah. you know, got like decent, did decently well. And the other thing was once I started cooking on some episode ideas, I got like excited to, yeah, yeah, to like make more. And then we did, uh, then you moved to New York. I did. And Dude, uh, we were doing Zoom sessions, bro. Yeah. Yes. Well, we had a lot of sessions in this apart in this uh, house. Right here, we had a different yeah. setup, and we literally yeah. just had whiteboard the screen and yeah, yeah, just hours of recording. Yeah, of Joe us would write the talking. script, and then we'd go over it. Well, because like, first it was writing. It w well, it was I had a general idea of like the vague arc. structure of yeah. the season yeah. and like what the episodes would be. But we didn't know what order they would be in, and it was very like loose. So yeah. then we would meet. Uh, to uh, come up with it. yeah, to come up yeah. with everything, we would come up with jokes and like dialogue and stuff like that. Then yeah. I would go home and like use the recording from those sessions yeah, to, to like write edit, out the script. Yeah. Then I would bring the script back, and then we would go over all the lines and shit and and read it out and yeah. say what works and what doesn't. Right. Yeah, and you'll you'll notice in this one, it's just it's a completely different feel. Like the first episode, I basically brought like the the concept of it, like guys, let's do it, and we sat down. We talk shit. Everyone started putting in bits together and we just had like a skeleton. Yeah. And then fucking like a week later, you're just like, hey, I wrote a script. And we're like, well, what the fuck? It was, That's yeah. awesome. A and vital part of that was if I didn't think like 10 minutes in to start recording that, yeah, that it was wouldn't great. have happened. It was just like was very, the yeah, decision you, to record it. And I didn't even tell you guys like, because I yeah. listened to it back recently and I was just like, uh, um, it would be fun to throw those up too because I have a bunch of recordings of like yeah. our sessions on my phone and uh but you yeah, might have to edit them. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, there's some. There's some <laughs> they might want to. They might want to give them a read through. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, a final a pass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, but the, you'll see. It's the difference is it was kind of like a like a super mixed brainchild, like the yeah. first one. The second one, you were just like, dude, I'm bringing you guys fucking four scripts right now. Yeah. And then we're like, all right, motherfucker. And then we have to sit down and just constantly tag them up and yeah. And yeah, I think there's a lot of punch bits. up -y stuff. That's all I yeah. feel like. I could, yeah, like the first yeah. episode I felt like was like we each kind of wrote a third of it in a lot of ways. But then yeah. after that, it was kind of like Joe and then we, you know, we would go over it. Full yeah. I think script. the first pro the, the, Issue not with the episode itself, but but with the whole show was my idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that yeah, it's, it's, channel. it's my yeah. yeah. My name is Jake Ricker. <laughs> yeah, Jake. Anyway, Jake has been playing. Uh, Jake has been playing yeah. Jake, been playing but he's Jake. really Kristoff. It's based on I'm your life. Jake playing Kristoff, playing Kristoff, and he's Jake playing Cri Cri Blake. And I'm Kristoff, and I'm, like, <laughs> I'm yeah. super gay. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm my name is Dragon in real life. <laughs> no, the, the, uh, Dragon these nuts, dude. But the the first episode, I think the the issue we had making it was that um, it was it kind of lacked like a sense of like roles and like oh I yeah think there were I didn't I didn't was like I just wrote this for Jake and then he'll like direct or whatever he'll get it done and then I think. Uh, it, there was like a time where I wasn't there and you were having a lot of hard time with Joe or whatever. And I was oh like, okay, so we need, we need to like, at the first time he acted him trying to remember lines. Yeah. It I, was pretty. I mean, the thing is like for this stuff, I'm like, I don't know how film sets work. I have no mm -hmm. idea. So I was like, well, I, guess, I don't, do we need a director? You know, like that's how dumb I am. I was just like, bro, we make sketches. Yeah. We'll yeah, yeah. We've never made a sketch with a director, you know, yeah. like we're never like sitting around like, let's make this YouTube video and um, someone will say action. You know, it's like ridiculous. Yeah. But for this, it was just so many lines and there were bits of exposition that just need to be done correctly. Mm -hmm. Like, uh -huh. and I had a sense. very, you know, specific thing in my head of what yeah. it was supposed to sound like. So yeah. I'm like, Oh, the fact that I wasn't there and they were just like, what is this supposed to sound like? Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. You know? yeah. Cause I was, Jake also, has to interpret it. I was yeah. interpreting and I was also like literally Acting over 50% of the dialogue while having to direct someone that just didn't do their homework. Yeah. And yeah. I'm just yeah. like getting fed. He's like one of my best friends. So, you know, when you're with a best friend, your best friend's fucking up. You're like, dude, what the fuck? Yeah. yeah like, yeah. you can kind of go a you little bit harder on to, each other. Yeah. It's like it becomes less like you, less professional. Le you're like, dude, stop fucking up. Yeah. Like, it come becomes on. too familiar. Yeah. No, that makes sense. Yeah. It, it was also. Yeah. yeah a little it was bit. like you were just you just had so many hats on all at the same time. Like you were acting in it as the main character. Like Luke's coming to you for like videography stuff like it's yeah. your house you're produ you're getting all the props like you did like 19 things and then you're like 
Now I have to remember Joe's lines and direct him. Yeah, like, I was literally you know I mean? it's like yeah. feeding him his it's lines. It's like the 90th <laughs> thing you've done to build up to that scene. So it's just like, yeah. if you can obfuscate that responsibility. Yeah, I think better. clearly Obfusc- establishing obfuscate. our roles not, and not stepping on each other's toes yeah. and like being like, it was like a more of a machine. Yeah. And so, yeah. And will, when Joe's do- directing... It's really easy to just kind of do what I want to do because oh God, he won't because like he doesn't have any balls like literally <laughs> yeah like, he has dude. one ball he's kind of a pussy so mm-hmm. if I he goes oh maybe <laughs> he goes oh maybe there was a split second where when you said when you were starting to talk about my directing I thought you would be like sincere for a second. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck you dude. like I, I was no. prepared for you to say something sweet <laughs> and then <laughs> look well it's f- whatever but. Uh, <laughs> No, but seriously, like, you know, I'm on set. I, I, I'm doing it my way. Joe will go, maybe more like this. And I go, maybe shut the fuck up. You know? <laughs> maybe maybe let me act. And the, you direct. You don't want you to direct yourself out of my fucking way. That's mm-hmm. what I used to say to him. And Joe. <laughs> Roll the tape. <laughs> play, the, play the bottle. Play the and wine Joe, bottle argument. Legit, play it right now. Legit. We're, we, we'll probably post behind the scenes at some point. There's a lot of just Joe crying. Mm-hmm. There's a lot. It's of, me being an alpha, and you're yeah. <laughs> you're the one freaking out and getting emotional yeah, like dude. a little girl about you know, a fucking well, wine bottle. Yeah, well, you know, yeah. yeah. Like, one <laughs> time I remember, I remember I did a line better than it was written. I kind of made up my own thing, and Joe said, "No, that's what not was a line. it? What was it? Uh, you said uh, you you wanted me to say you, you, like you want to uh, yeah go. No, uh, do you want me to say what happened, or do you want me to <laughs> go do, ahead. I'm Joe? I'm trying to hear him. Yeah, yeah thank you. Um, so it was the scene with, um, me and Jake at the game store and you wanted me to say like, Oh, Hey Jake, how's it going? And I was like, what, what is this crap? Mm -hmm. And then I was like, what's up dog? Shit. So yeah, for the, <laughs> <laughs> I think the rest of the season definitely was a better process. <laughs> uh, it, was, it was really nice being able to like take a step back. Yeah, for sure. And it was it was just better overall. Just yeah, because sure. it's like the person that put together like the actual bulk of the writing of like the actual like this is how it is in my head. It's like yeah. you already know. Mm-hmm. And it's, it's just great being able to have someone who gets to take a step back. Yeah. Like growing yeah. up, I was like. I never really understood. Like I was like, dude, the director just he doesn't write the script. Like he's yeah, just yeah. telling people what to do. And I'm looking at it, like understanding now, it's like they are insanely crucial. Yeah, it's kind of like the CEO of a company. Like they have to take a step back and be like, all right, where's some wh- who's fucking up right now? Yeah, yeah. Like, okay, this needs to fix, and then this will be great. Yeah, and that's yeah. what you got to do. And I think it was very, uh, like you know, uh, I learned a lot. Yeah. As you know, just like because there is a lot of questions being thrown your way, and you have to always have an answer, and you gotta, you gotta. Mm-hmm. But I, I think it, the b- biggest thing I, I took away is allowing other people to do things. Like a lot of the time, people would have ideas that were better than what I had in my head, as far as like uh, sh- letting people improvise, like Dean or whatever. And then, yeah. I mean, even in the script, there's like a ton of stuff that's not even written. It's like we'll figure that out later. <laughs> I mean, the the. Uh, the bit you'll see with the um dirty dancing was just you guys riffing yeah. we literally wrote in the script like and then christoph hypes up jake yeah and we'll figure it out and then we figured sh- it out in our living room yeah yeah, and we, yeah. you didn't even know didn't we you meet us around. at the game store and we sent him a video of it yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> we were just we were practicing him i was like you, uh, you were like i can definitely lift you over my head i'm like i'm like 160 pounds I don't know. You're like, yeah i could definitely lift that over my head <laughs> like that's really big i'm a little bit guy and then also Sean in the script. It, oh. All of his dialogue Sean's at the beginning so is great. written, but then it, at the end it just goes like, Sean will come up with something. Yeah. And then also, I didn't. <laughs> he came in with that voice, and I was like, I really pictured as more of like a regular human being, you know? Like, <laughs> more like Sean, just as a, you know, just a more of a person. Yeah, like, a, like guy. a guy. <laughs> yeah, I, I told just... him at the beginning, he's doing the voice. I'm like, well, we can do that, you know, like after, but I just want some lines of you, like, just, you know, you got a PhD, like be like a regular person. Yeah. And, uh, and then we were doing it, and it was kind of working, and I was just, trying to get him to do what i want and then at the end i just go like just do the voice <laughs> and that's what that's <laughs> changed what the entire in. scene and like we just kind of riffed around so i'm yeah. like okay it's like a lot of the time it's, yeah. it's what well, it is like a cartoonish scene yeah so yeah sense. and the benefit of it is it's it's not just like we have actors like not shitting on actors but actors like they take someone's art and they bring it to life with us we got to do that but you also have fucking comics we're mm-hmm. constantly on stage just talking shit so you're like they'll be funny 
Yeah. yeah. You know, like you can really rely on like the yeah. your I mean, characters. Sean's, Sean's a bona fide actor. Yeah. No, that I mean, he's a he's a great a, actor. And a great comic. And but he's Dean. also a good comic. Yeah. So like even Dean, you know? Yeah. yeah, Dean, same thing. Because like there's someone that could be an incredible actor, but you're like, all right, now be funny. They don't get the yeah, timing. They can't do it. You know, like uh, there's comedic actors, but it's yeah. like for someone to be dramatic and also be funny, I don't know. I just I feel like yeah, it's really comic nice having comics. Great mm-hmm. for that, yeah. You know. Yeah, no, there's a, it's, we got lucky that we only use unpaid comedians yeah. <laughs> to be We're in used our to movie. doing it for nothing. Yeah. I'm like, there'll be There's only, the only, like, <laughs> Will people be in it that weren't comics were, like, Lorena in episode three, Arden, and mm. uh, that's it. Just the two women, because, you know. There are no women in comedy. Yeah, there's. <laughs> two, they don't exist. <laughs> yeah. It's not for lack of trying. But yeah, we wrote it, and that took a while, and then I had cancer, and then Christoph moved. We actually did most of it when you were in New York. I think even most yeah, of the writing, yeah. and then we just shot everything with you. And yeah, you got Christoph back, would come down then, to visit family and his girl, and we'd just yeah. be like, all right, dude, we need to steal you. Yeah, yeah. And we would just like fucking take Christoph him for would be like, I'm back. Day. I'm back. I got a haircut. Oh, oops. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I wore a hat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody's pointed that out, though. So it doesn't look <laughs> that good. different. I watched yeah. it today. It's like... The, it does kind of conceal it wearing a hat. We, we cover it, it. It all flows. The, yeah, yeah. It's if anyone's gonna notice anything, it, it, maybe it's just me watching myself that my hair is all over the place. Mm-hmm. <laughs> really, up and down. I didn't notice yep. a little so, bit. You were, I mean, you were pretty consistent about getting haircuts and such. Yeah. I mean, the biggest change is obviously episode two to episode yeah. or episode one, to episode two. I, my, every time I just would go to my barber like once every couple of weeks and just be like, I need to look the like the exact this. same. Yeah, yeah. Just show them pics from get good. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But yeah, it was, so, it was so much fun to shoot. Having yeah. captain there to be racist. Captain was <laughs> 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 There's some behind the scenes stuff that has never seen the light of day, never going but to is see the light funnier of day. than anything in the show. <laughs> yeah. Hey, he's a kid, dude. It's yeah. not his fault. <laughs> Well, you watched it. Uh, Captain was so much fun. Yeah, yeah. Captain doing behind the scenes. He's the funniest just doing, guy. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Even, we'll, we'll, we might release it somewhere for the Patreon. You <laughs> yeah. can see. It. Yeah. That's but, Bay Walsa. Yeah, yeah. I like telling that joke to you guys. That was fun. <laughs> Which one? Oh, that was great. Yeah, that was <laughs> fun. Like a, that was like sleepover delirium. Yeah, yeah. That was. We had the zoomies. <laughs> <laughs> we had the zoomies yeah. big time. No, just laughing our asses Ooh. off. Yeah. The first thing we shot for this, we, we did we do the office or the game store first? I think we did the game store. I remember the game store. Because the behind yeah. the scenes, my hair is short, like really short. Yeah. Yes, you're right. Yeah, we did game store first. That was when we kissed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I could show you that. <laughs> I mean, we didn't kiss. I'm kidding. Yeah, we that almost did. Bro, we wrapped up at like, we wrapped shooting there at like 2.33. That's when we went to Denny's, dude. That just sucked ass. Oh, my God. Fuck Denny's. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck Denny's, bro. bro. That took forever. And then we did, I remember the, the office shoot was long, dude. Yeah, that, that was, was like long. A I don't remember it being super annoying. Like, there wasn't any like kind of like big issue with... uh. Yeah, I just remember there being so many extras and everybody's coming in and out. You had to leave, but then you came back. Yeah. And, uh, but there was, we didn't get kicked out of anywhere or anything or like. Nothing serious. Only yeah. the parking lot was, and that was just, we drove like half a block. The, the office felt the most like a movie set or yeah. like not a movie set, like a studio yeah. because it was literally like, all right, here's set one. Set two, set, and we were yeah. jumping between different things. And there was even break rooms and stuff. And we didn't have to nice. rush out. There was other locations where we were like yeah. really freaking out because we had to be out by a certain time. And this is where Luke really uh, fucking shined, dude. Luke yeah. literally would set up every single room and make it look fucking awesome. Yeah, yeah. like with the like, lighting. Um, do you like the lighting? He'd drop two. Cam- <laughs> yeah, he would drop, he'd drop well, two the, cameras. Uh, the fucking the drunk lady at. Oh my god! The marathon. We're yeah. gonna do this. So okay, <laughs> it's hilarious. I love me. it. No, I thought we were gonna go like one by oh, one. Oh, That's okay. because like I can drop chapters. No, no this is actually. A lot well, we funnier. also shot it out of order. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Oh yeah, for that anyway. Yeah, you had. We had to do like all right, everything in the Christoph office one day. Mm-hmm. We ended up doing two days in the office and picking up extra. Yeah. Um, getting, everything in the game store one day. Everything. Yeah, in yeah, the that's coffee the way to do it, like, locations. Yeah. Getting Christoph's stuff out of the way, I think, was a big hurdle. Yeah. I'm because sorry. we only had you for a certain amount of time. Well, you did, you know you were there. Yeah. But uh, we only had you for a certain amount of time, and uh, <laughs> we was... didn't shoot any of the montage. Uh, with you no and then we shot stuff way later everything yep. we shot so out of order everybody's getting different haircuts Arden dyed her hair i don't know if people are that I mean, works with continuity because yeah. it's between episodes yeah but one of the, the probably one of the most stressful things is he was just bringing up we have a scene at the gas station and we 
thank God we did it just without asking gorilla style because yeah. when we went back to get like a two second shot, they were like, get on my stool. <laughs> they got mad at us. So we shot it after we just filmed like for five plus hours at coffee and record store. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, show yeah. up. We just were like, this, the lights are still on. This looks fucking awesome. We drop the sticks, everything's set up. We're about to hit record and some, Fucking drunk crackhead yeah. <laughs> just decides to saunter on over. Yeah. What are you guys doing? <laughs> dude, it was so funny. I mean, the moment we told her to be quiet is when it, <laughs> it just got bad. Dude, she comes up. The first thing, I don't remember if it was the first thing she said, but we're trying to record. Like, we're doing this. Thing. I can't act. And I'm like totally in a horrible yeah, space for this. Yeah, there's something crazy going on. Yeah. And then she goes, she's watching us act. She goes, this isn't even fucking real. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are lying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She goes, you guys are lying. And we're like, what? She goes, you're not even making something real. <laughs> like, and we're trying to point. explain what a movie is. To her. <laughs> we're like, yeah, it's fictional. It's like we, you know, we're yeah, reading we're, lines right now. We just yeah, need to be quiet. And she's like, like you're lying to people. You know, this is my freedom of speech, right? Yeah, now. yeah. We we're just like, man, we just have to get a shot. Can I can be wherever I want. <laughs> yeah. I can be wherever I want. <laughs> I, I can be as talk. loud as I care. Yeah, I think <laughs> freedom of speech. And we're then like, Ross just... was over there playing a crackhead. Yes, he, he had to be basically what she is. <laughs> <laughs> well, what was great too? I mean, it's not great, but the the darkest moment that is like kind of horrifically funny. And she's like looking at Arden, and she goes, "Look at this fucking slut." That was like. Oh yeah. shit! Dude. Yeah. Dude, we like, dapped her up for that. One. <laughs> <laughs> on God, no, no, no. No, on God, bro. We, we were, I was being so polite, just like man, bro, you we, were ready to murder her. I know, but so, <laughs> I, I want to curse her the fuck out. But yeah, I was like, Steve the only way to get her going, I was yeah. like, man, I'm, we're trying to film something, and Luke, <laughs> Luke was ready with like a backstory, like we're filming something, we're students, we're filming, it's for school. Yeah, like, yeah, he was, yeah, he was yeah. like he was trying to. He went overboard a couple times with that. Yeah, we're going to PSA about depression. Yeah. Something like that. We were just like, man, just for like while we're recording, please, you please, you can hang out just while we're recording. Just can you keep it quiet. down just so we can like get the clean audio? And she's like, I'm allowed to talk wherever I want. It's America. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's not what I'm saying. <laughs> that's true, man. You can do that. Yeah. My, what did she end up leaving for? I think she just walked once away. we stopped we engaging stopped, with her, she got bored. Yeah, yeah. We were just completely, yeah. That, I mean, we should have given her because she was took a stance water. and was like, I'm staying. And that she was like doing that just to like, cause we were like Annoyed. conflicting with her. And then the moment we stopped engaging that, she was like, oh, well, I guess there's no point in me being here yeah. <laughs> other than she to piss people off. Yeah. Right, right before we realized she, well, I'm sorry, like once we realized like she's fucking this up and she's crazy, my favorite part, you look at Ross and you go, all right, Ross. Be that exactly. Yeah. <laughs> well, really, because here is our motivation. Yeah, honestly, I almost wanted to like include her in the scene somehow and like see if we could improv that, but that was just we just need to get That'd her out of there. Ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. It was. I've never because I, I I've done. I I don't want to say thousands, hundreds of shows with you, hundreds mm -hmm. of like live performances. We've yeah, made least. fifty plus. 50 plus sketches together. Made a million I've times. never, I, when I was watching, I was like, oh, this is fucking this up for us. I was yeah. watching you like, I was like, Christoph, we need to get this bitch out of here. Yeah, I was really <laughs> upset. It was really upsetting. Me. And it's sad, just her life. Yeah. You know? I don't yeah. feel bad for her. <laughs> yeah. Some drunk <laughs> asshole waddled over. I mean, she's just being hammered and annoying. Moves. Yeah, I guess dude. if you can sympathize with like, you know, she she's overdosed a, she's that night. Bro, it was like a alcoholic. Monday night and she's blacked out. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, what yeah. do you guys do it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, I don't have that much sympathy for this. Yeah. Nah, this Bothering is Bothering some kids trying to make a PSA about depression. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to talk about how cool homeless people are. Here. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, as far as acting in general, you you took a class. Jake took an acting class, mm -hmm. but in yep. between, mm -hmm. uh, Christoph, I think, already took the same class. Yeah. I'm just a natural. Yeah, that's how we <laughs> met. <laughs> and we met Arden through Sean, who took the classes. Yeah. As well. And that was Arden's first uh, thing. She's done a, a bunch of like student films since then, but she, that was the first thing she was ever in. And I think we s set her up to think sets are that fun. <laughs> But they're yeah. not. They're well, not that racist. Some, like, seri <laughs> yeah. If you're making some like serious like UCF film, like it's probably not that fun. Yeah, no. Yeah. They're not All like the goofing off. But like she, the yeah, she was great though because we didn't have anybody else lined up. That was so funny when <laughs> yeah. she came in and read yeah. as if we had other options. Yeah. Well, we needed to know if she was good or not. But yeah, we weren't like. 
We were like, mm, we'll, we'll like, should we tell her we're gonna but... call her back? We know it's her. Yeah, we should just yeah. be like, yeah, yeah you're good. And she <laughs> yeah. had like a really, she has a cool gamer look. She has a Sailor Moon tattoo. I was like, oh, this is yeah, what a, a yeah, gamer a girl fit, would have. Yeah. She fit the great. part perfectly. She looked the right age. She was yeah. good and also had to do a lot. There was like a whole episode that's so much of her. So centered around So we her. got really lucky yeah. with her. Yeah. And yeah, we got we lucky with Lorena too because there were Lorena, other yeah, actors we reached out to that didn't want to do it. Yeah, she was really funny. A- actors, that whole scene is so funny. Actors were like, we don't want to do it because it's a comedy. Or like one actor was like. Really? She was like, I yeah. love it. I think it's so funny. But like, I'm just worried about being in a comedy because you know how people are these days. Really? Yeah, yeah she's yeah. worried about offending people. <laughs> no being like, way. well, it can ostracize me from other roles. That's yeah. insane. Which is fair. You know, I guess it sucks that that's the case. Yeah. And and I think even well, we caught a lot of like the edgiest stuff. I think <laughs> yeah. you saw it today. There's nothing really that's like that. No. Crazy in it. No. Yeah. Not to I'm the worst guy to ask about that. I know, but even I have in, no metric. In general. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. is that a bad? Is that bad? No, we, we, no we, you and you were the one with the the I think yeah, I know. that one I didn't set- want. <laughs> 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 I was riffing. Yeah. There, no, that, that, is, that is that is the a funniest- way better option <laughs> that we didn't use. That's the funniest joke in the whole show, in my opinion. Like, <laughs> we just it was like a long deliberation of like, should we cut it out? Yeah, it's no, you I'm playing glad. guitar. Yeah. Like, yeah, go ahead. Tell, tell us the bit. I don't. I really don't. <laughs> you, I can't even remember. I forget. Guitar. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my guitar on me. No, but we we for the most part we cut anything unnecessary. You know, what I mean, like we we had a couple like like I wouldn't even call them low blows, but something that like rode the line of like edgy that just wasn't funny enough. We chopped and fit. everything in there fits. And we yeah. there's a couple we were times very we conscious swing, of a larger fine. audience. You What's know, that? I think we were very conscious of a larger audience. It's not like we even whether or not you know this comes out tomorrow, whether or not it like you know fucking blows up you know or anything I, I, we did go into it thinking like if this person sees this what are they going to think like yeah. if, if this group of people sees this are they going to like like we were trying to almost make it as if we were putting it on tv yeah and be like what would fly or like what yeah. would what would what every would be, possible uh, take of it be yeah i just think it's just like all the comedy in it is like earned and like mm-hmm. the context calls for something darker or edgier and it's not yeah. like out of place you know yeah and i think and pretty for much, gamers, it's pretty tame. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, if we really only had an audience of gamer, yeah. we just say the N word. <laughs> <laughs> no, like no, in the no. first episode, I have that bit about um, what's it called, where like someone's yelling on me on Xbox, and I just say, "You can't say the N word. I'm not black. You don't sound black." Oh no. Yeah. P- the comments on that are like. Come on, pussy! Yeah. Come on. Okay, tell us what's really being. I mean, said. that's that's exactly you're you pretend that this this is not how you freak out. Yeah, Come that's on. exactly what I was thinking when you said that. <laughs> I was like, can we do a different take? You should just say it. <laughs> no, 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 no. Just kidding. No, you can be black. <laughs> no, I think I, uh, Dude, we have some like fucking hitters in the show. If you think about it, like the people, even in smaller roles, you got Sean Finnerty at the bar. Mm-hmm. Yep, he first Irish t- person to on the, ever do on the Tonight Show. Yep, you got Cam Patterson in it. Yep. Yeah, kill, kill Tony, Tony favorite. Regular. Don't don't say who he is. I want that to be a surprise. I won't surprise, but he's in the show. Yep. He's like, hey, hey, bro, I love this shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, I love I love this rocks. Shit. He's just yeah. he's just throwing rocks. At us. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Cam being in it was well. It's also funny because. To say that uh, the original person for that part was David Jolly, who's also also on Kill Tony. Tony and shit. Yeah, yeah so but David Jolly is a fucking crackhead. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Jolly had a show, and he had um he had a show, and then the next yeah, morning the also had a show in a different town. He had to catch a bus for. Yeah, and yeah. this was the only day we had the bar, and I was like, fuck. Yeah, it was like, the last dude, minute. he's like, dude, I can't make it. I was like. Yeah. Fuck, who can I get? And immediately, we were like, dude, Cam. let's get fucking Cam. Yeah. And we were worried because the scene, we wanted him to be like kind of powerful. And Cam's not like the biggest dude. Yeah. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Jolly's like a big dude. But he's, Cam's extremely nice. Too. Yeah. yeah. But he, Which made the scene too. When yeah. It's actually really made nice it funnier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, 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 yeah. it's a flip. He's such mm-hmm. a kind soul. Versus yeah. like Jolly, it's just, an, it could be intimidating the whole time because yeah. I think he's about, is he my height or maybe taller? He's at least, yeah. He's at least my height. He's, like he's got like gold teeth. So it's like, it's intense, like when I'm having to deal with that in a confined space. But with Cam, <laughs> it was just like, oh, dude, this is fun. Yeah. And then when it flips, it really flips. You're like, whoa, whoa. Yeah. yeah well, because yeah, yeah. it was also so last minute that we were worried, like, because he would need to learn his lines, like, he did it so with quick. two seconds beforehand. Bro. And he would Nailed improv. It. And, like, it was mostly because I was at, like, some fucking dinner or something. And then I came to the bar right after. 
and uh, and I just saw him in the clothes and him with the gun, like doing his lines. I'm like, he's a superstar. I'm yeah. like, I, I had the the Tony Hinchcliffe moment of like, you're a star. Yeah. I'm like, you're he's incredible. Be huge. Yeah. But it really was the like future. the charisma of Cam just translated so much to like the. I was like, dude, you just took this immediately and like made it way better. I think than yeah, we no, could have imagined. Cam's great. I read the lines like five times with him before. Hey, I, he like me. I don't even think he met. He was just like. Bro, fuck yeah. And he just fucking ran through it Yeah, real just quick. seeing him in the costume, I'm like, you look hilarious. Yeah, I had to run to Party <laughs> yeah. City like 20 yeah. minutes before and buy different party clothes City? to fit him where no one has more party for less. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he, he was great. Because we shot the bar like for like yeah. four or five hours and then had to go break because we were, Jolly had a show. Yeah. And then he calls me. He's like, dude, I can't make it. The show's still going. I'm like, yeah. Fuck. All right, well, we'll wait for you. He goes, I have to sleep tonight. I have to be up at like five to make a bus. And that's when we hit cam up and I had to go drive around. We fucking scrambled yeah. and then put together a really cool scene. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who else is on it, though? You got Sean has his own big YouTube going on. Yeah, Philippe. Sean Philippe. Lorena. He's great. Lorena's He's huge. Yeah. Lorena's huge on like TikTok and IG and shit. There you go. I mean, yeah. we got some. A couple you know, mil on, I, couple mil on TikTok. Yeah, we spent Two, a whole day. 200K on it. On you on weren't it. there for um, the fucking montage stuff over there. She was yeah. great. No, well, it's, it's, no, watching one, it's just, one thing about the show that was crazy to me is that there was really stuff in there, like more than a few scenes, and especially the montage where I'm like, it's almost fun the risk of like I really don't know if it's gonna work because yeah. the process of going from like writing it and then six months later shooting See, it you yeah. have the idea for this whole long thing with all these episodes and then you there's certain parts where you're like this could work or it could not yeah. you know it's like really we didn't know it, it was gonna work until it happened yeah. and then uh, it's a big swing same with the fight scene I wanted to take it out completely when we were writing it and Jake was like we're gonna do it and I'm yeah. like it's, it's episode a lot. four I did, I was like we don't have to do it it's like so its own thing yeah you know why not just like cons- use our time more wisely and jake's like we're doing episode we're doing episode four yeah there was a lot of jake t- there was a getting lot of, things done that i thought were yeah, impossible yeah that was pretty amazing but you know i mean that was like i just had to trust you where i'm just like <laughs> anytime you said we could do something i was like i mean he's hasn't been wrong so yeah, far he's done everything else yeah yeah <laughs> no, we got it done it, yeah. it, 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 it was a team thing it was all it was a lot of fucking work yeah for sure dude but i mean you producing it was integral. Yeah. Integral. Ooh, thank you. Integral. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I pulled my weight around. The only person that yeah, shouldn't even be much. here right now is uh, Christoph. Um, what? Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I did, okay, dude. Without me. <laughs> okay. First of all, without me, who's gonna play Christoph? <laughs> There's a huge hole in your logic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, this is some other guy playing Christoph. Uh, yeah. We could have recast. No, you couldn't have. You're With nothing. whom? You're RV. Nothing. We could have just r- put RV. <laughs> you wouldn't yeah. even notice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We were worried about that. We re- When I said when we were watching the looked too similar to me. Yeah. We rearranged the B-roll that's the my lead up oath. to like space you and him out. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's my bottle. Yeah. That's your. That's you if you, you smoke cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> and, we're cool. and we're cool. Yeah. And that was cool. And that we're if fucking If pants. your mom fed you baby uh, PBR in a baby <laughs> 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 But uh, yeah, dude. But yeah, as far as acting, you guys played yourselves basically. Whereas, uh, I mean, obviously with differences, but like same name and same general vibe. Yeah, yeah it's weird, right? Because I'm writing the credits like Jake as Jake. Yeah, <laughs> Christoph as, as that was mostly his laziness. We're like, there's no point in giving you guys a different name. Yeah. Or like, but yeah. then other. What, what would my name have been? Like Ezekiel or something like cool or like Dante? Uh, yeah, or Dante. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny if I was just named Dante. <laughs> 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 and we never address it. Yeah, I mean, Doctor. <laughs> Bologna, Dr. Baloney came from Sean giving us his idea of what that scene should be. Did he name him Dr. Baloney? Well, he sent us like, here's a scene that I came up with for a therapist. And it was it was just fucking ridiculous. <laughs> we didn't use it, but it, the, the name he put down was Dr. Baloney. <laughs> <laughs> we thought it was so funny. <laughs> we just called him Dr. I Bologna. I love stuff yeah. like that. I, for the therapy thing, I originally wanted to do my gamer therapy once. But yeah. it just turned it, we were like, Whenever you wrote your side, I was like, oh, this is fucking great. You well, just do this. Part of the story. that, de- the, yeah, that s- the story definitely needed to be established. And I thought I could go from that into the, the gamer therapy. But it really, that sketch wouldn't have fit in the, the context of the episode. Mm. It would have yeah. just been a gaming. It would have just been. A, that could still be a standalone yeah. sketch. Yeah, if Dr. Anything. Bologna is so fucking funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I love. Yeah, the show I like. It's not afraid to be just absurdly dumb and like a, in the best way. Yeah, I think I think it does have a a good sense of uh, like 
absurdity that's Silliness. also grounded. Like yeah. we we do, it, it is very character driven. Yeah. In terms of like the humor is very char- it's character based a lot of the time. Yeah. And uh, and they change and have stories. Yeah, and there is a storyline. Like there's very little like non sequiturs. Yeah. And uh, but at the same time, you have the the vibe of like we can do whatever we want. There's no logic to anything. Yeah, happening. yeah, yeah. You know, like if we want to have like a bird swoop down and take somebody away in the middle of an episode, it could which happen. I really want to do. In season <laughs> two. Mark my words, if we do season two, someone will be. There's someone will be at a random point <laughs> taken away by a giant hawk, and <laughs> we're never gonna talk about it. Yeah. <laughs> or or way That'd later, we're gonna one. be like, yeah, yeah like that I have time out. Idea for that. <laughs> yeah. Um. No, that's fucking. No, that's dope, dude. So I mean, it's I feel like, like people don't. I don't know if there's that much of that going on, like in like mainstream comedy stuff. It's just being really stupid. Yeah, I mean, Hot Rod and What Hot American Hot Summer. Hot Rod and like, What Hot American Summer. Like Rick and Morty would do it every yeah, now and Rick then, and Morty. where it'd be like this Rick insane so plot, meta, dude. and then slip yeah, in a yeah. fart out of Rick nowhere. And Morty still is like really <laughs> snappy and meta. So it, the it, meta ness annoys me. Rick and Morty sometimes. Although we do rip first, off Rick and Morty for this too. But <laughs> for sure, the first I love three it. Seasons of Rick and Morty when I was yeah. I absolutely no, yeah no great. you're you're love absolutely right yeah it's incredible. No, yeah. it's a great show. Yeah, no, it's and we do rip it off, but the, the, <laughs> don't get me wrong. I, I, I'm all caught up. I know it, but the um, as far as the, yeah, like I just wanted it to be like if we want to do a bit where Jake gets addicted to heroin and then we just he becomes sober and gets married, we can just do that. Yeah. And there's no there's no sense of like this is unrealistic, or or you know like a fucking. I, I want to rip off the cool beans thing from Hot Rod. Maybe we'll do that season two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cool beans. The two things cool I really beans. wanted to do. Uh, the only thing that's like it, I wouldn't even call it rip off because it's it's a different like the scenes are different. Everything like it's way longer, way different from the montage. It's definitely heavily inspired. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. No, know. we didn't rip anything off. Yeah. I think it's mostly just we use the song and it's very obvious that we were inspired by it. But yeah. hopefully yeah. people don't care because that was fucking tough is figuring different songs. But Bro, fucking music. Yeah, it's music brutal. was way harder than we thought. But, but the- YouTube came in clutch with just like, yeah, you can post it. You won't get a strike. It's just you can't monetize it. Like, yeah, dude, let's just put something yeah, dope out. Yeah, sure, why decision. Not? And that's also something that's really cool is like since for like at least for season one, it's like the invested interest is just like, all right, how do we make as many people see it? It's not like, all right, how do we fucking turn a profit for our investors? Yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah. we just want to make something that we know everyone's going to like, and that's going to be put out there. So it's like, if we need yeah. to make a, a sacrifice of not getting paid on something for a bit, it's like, all right, yeah, one of the apps will just fucking take that punch. Yeah, yeah I just, you know? I like that we made something that I'm, we're very proud of and, and we, uh, people might see it. That's the only thing I care about right now. It'd be Same. really cool if it led to something else, but yeah. You know, whatever, dude. It was it's good. Of making a good thing for a good, a large base of people to see, which yeah. is like more than most anyone can say. And the general consensus of like all the people who have watched it, and this is my favorite compliment towards it, which is this is actually good. Yeah. Like that's when your friend tells you to watch, like, oh, I made a video or watch my pilot. They usually, like, even before, like close friends will be like, all right. Yeah. Yeah. And then after they watch it, they're just like, this is actually good. Yeah. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. they are expecting like really it to be trash. Made an effort. And- yeah. Th- this is cringe, but I think I told Jake, my mom said this, but she came, you know, to my. Yeah. Show. What? No, go ahead. This my is mommy? Quinge. My yeah, mommy said, said, This is quinge. And you're <laughs> yeah. like, Why are you laughing? <laughs> no, because uh, this is quinge. <laughs> um, the. My mom came to my birthday, you know, just to have dinner with me and be there in New Orlando. And yeah. she went to the screening or it was just like, you know, like 10 of my friends or whatever. Mm-hmm. And uh, to, and we showed them like an unfinished version. It was like 20 some people there, dog. Uh, yeah, like 15, I think. There was probably yeah, like 47 there was, people. There was people, yeah. yeah. I got, yeah. I'm popular. But at the... Um, <laughs> My my mom was there and she was she was getting hammered, but in a, <laughs> in a cool way. She was a lot yeah. of fun, and she watched it and saw everybody's reaction to it. And I guess when she was visiting family, talking to everybody, she came back and was like, "Oh yeah, I was telling people. I guess I realized that was like the proudest moment of my life." Oh, and I was like, "You're gay. <laughs> <laughs> You're gay. <Yeah. laughs> That's yeah. so sweet." Yeah. No, it was good to hear. I mean, this is my proudest accomplishment in my life for sure. Mm-hmm. As far as like the scale of it, I've yeah. done anything a bigger scale so or that far, I'm more yeah. proud of like the writing or anything. I mean, the yeah, like other stuff I've written, even stuff that's more me. <laughs> <laughs> you got so scared, dude. <laughs> all right, all right. Sorry, I was just trying to deflate your little. <laughs> yeah, my ego. Right now. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I'm just trying to tickle you. Oh, your mom cares. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Oh, my mom 
Tell me so. My video and she said it was the proudest moment of her life. So this is my proudest moment. Mm-hmm. We're kissing. Mm-hmm. Where's my boy? Mm-hmm. Where's my son? Mm-hmm. And they go, Mommy, heart Joe stop. has sex with his mother. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, the, that's the bit. <laughs> no, but that's awesome. No, that's great. You fuck she, your mom. That's she, awesome, dude. <laughs> so, I'm trying to reel it back in. My, I, my whole body gets red all the way. <laughs> <laughs> my head turns Why into a I, I, yeah. I don't have sex with my mother. <laughs> but no, my yeah, I, I did get carried away there. Oh, I forgot to there. do my bit. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. We'll do it later. No, I was going to remind you, but right I don't want to force it. Smooth, yeah. Like, it's, yeah. yeah, well, whatever, man. Go ahead. But oh, that's we, awesome about your mom. <laughs> <laughs> she, really she, she talked to me after, No, too. it is gay. Uh, yeah, to cut she? that part out. Then yeah, what? I, no, not, I'm not, I'm not doing after, that bit. After she talked to you. She was just like, that, that was awesome. Thank yeah, She said, and, thank you. And and she was like, mom, that's mm, fucking and She's great. like, Jay, come here. Okay. My mom's a slut. Did you with that gut gut? Nine thousand. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Yeah, but uh, but yeah, no, I think it was a good mix of uh, me and Jake's sensibilities, and mm-hmm. you know, whatever. Yeah, for sure, dude. You guys were, you know. Do you like acting? You want to be an actor now? I like acting. Yeah, it's fun. Dude. It's fun. Yeah, uh, I I wouldn't mind it. Let's do more sketches. Yeah, we'll do more stuff. Yeah, when mm-hmm. I'm in New York, because I'm moving to New York too, mm-hmm. fellas, and we're gonna scab. <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. we're taking money from people. Yeah. I don't know. I'm either New There's York. There's a what? <laughs> yeah. um, I'm le- I I don't know. I'm, I'm like still up in the air. I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, we'll see. We'll life see, life dude. takes everybody in different directions. It yeah. would help my career immensely if I could continue to make things for you. But, That'd be sick, dude. But you know, for, with all... you, this is together. So oh yeah, yeah, with you, bro. yeah. Yeah, Give me some skin for that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hit the mic. <laughs> <laughs> um. Anything you guys want to plug or what's up? No, I'm just yeah. kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just it's my podcast. What's up? Check out Rough Week. <laughs> <laughs> These are my guests. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Jake Jackson, Joe Ricca. Do, do you think people are going to have like context for any of this? Do you think they want to hear us talk about stuff they haven't seen yet in no, such I, detail? I think this goes back to like once they watch it, they'll go back and want to watch this. We can literally yeah. name the app like director's commentary. Yeah. Yeah. Or something like that. Or they'll be like, oh, yeah, that show I liked, you know, a while ago. It's coming back. Cool. Like yeah, that's the main purpose of it. Yeah, I'm not expecting them. To, like it's, it's like if Kristoff lived in town, I yeah. would be like, yeah, let's do an ep two right now. Yeah. All right, now let's do an ep three. Yeah, but it's like, like bro, just one. do it all together. We'll, yeah. we'll we can take individual clips I'll and be whenever back in town in like a you know a month. Yeah, so. and whenever yeah, we're filming the DVD, ep- we'll do a director's commentary. We'll yeah. watch it. Yeah, and the, the whole time all like, like, <laughs> oh god, <laughs> I'm the- going to come. Yeah. <laughs> 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 the, the people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> splendid sucking. <laughs> 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 Marvelous, marvelous <laughs> gucking you're going, oh, I'm finna bust. <laughs> <laughs> he throws in a finna. <laughs> a finna bust. <laughs> yeah. Excellent blowjob. That's what we were doing before. Yeah, yeah. I was doing he was that gonna voice. Open by going. I was going to pretend. This is when I went to grab the mic. I was going to pretend to be like a sort of like British aristocrat interviewing you about the show. I was like, Jake, what was your process? <laughs> what is it like being... A- the fat suit. How did you put that on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is it like the whale? <laughs> and did you take inspiration from Brennan Fraser? <laughs> so I understand you have diabetes. <laughs> <laughs> and Joe, as, as a homosexual, no, no, how have no. you felt no, just Jake, just Jake. No, no. <laughs> as a gay man... <laughs> What does sucking penis feel like? Uh, well, I've only ever sucked Kristoff, <laughs> and uh, it's so and small. Like, it's like <laughs> no, I'm no, just kind of kissing. No, I was no, just gonna, just gonna go. I, no, I'm done, no. <laughs> my brain is out. <laughs> what? What? You had a point? I can't remember. I'm just. This that was very funny. Oh, thanks, dude. <laughs> yeah, no, we'd be riffing but, and shit. Yeah, what I was saying, it's almost weird to stop riffing to be like, now we're communicating with uh, people with, who aren't in the room. Yeah, yeah, about but, the show. But it's like for when the other apps drop. Yeah. Yeah. I can literally just because we, we spoke about each one. Yeah, just reel it out, you know. But the people that yeah. really fucking love it can watch the full. No, if I were right. if I were a little fan of this, I would love to hear the behind.
behind the scenes. Yeah, and how it's me made. Too, and that of you course. can make t- content too. Yeah. You can do whatever you want in life. Put your mind yeah, to it. Yeah. You don't need a studio. Don't bro. let your dreams be dreams. Yeah. If you do it. Do it. If you want to make something, all you need is uh, a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> a ton of money. I mean, yeah. and, and a willingness to spend but it on for stuff. For me, that yeah. was no big deal. You know what I mean? Like yeah. dropping the, you know, and you 500k a, we put into this yeah yeah you I need put, a lot of subscribers <laughs> on YouTube. even that might not help you but yeah, uh, yeah. also um Just being a baller yeah having swag yeah. being a baller you know saying, getting dude. money getting bitches being a millionaire you guys want me to freestyle about the show yeah yeah uh. yeah um, yeah Get good episode two. It's coming to it's coming to you. It's gonna be on YouTube. You can watch it. You can jack off to the two. Joe's gay. Joe's really gay. He's gay. He sucks dick every day. He's sucking on the balls. Say hey. He's licking on my butt. He's licking on my butt. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? 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 Remix. <laughs> Yeah, so that's Sorry. why I wrote that. Do you think they the know show. who we are too? Like, do you think they want to know like how we met and stuff? Yeah. Well, do, I was. Do they want to know that we're actually friends. In yeah, your life? I was a doctor, and uh, Joe came in with cancer, <laughs> and I cured it with my mouth. What was your name again, Doctor Ganesh or something? <laughs> oh yeah, Doctor Patel. Doctor Patel. <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? Doctor <laughs> Ganesh. <laughs> Dr. Yeah. Patel. Um, Dr. Patel. A lot of the. Uh, me. It's there was me. two Dr. Patels at that same hospital. <laughs> I got, Patel mine is was Rick and. But uh, yeah, Rick and Patel took my ball out. Uh, oh, yeah, something yeah. Cohen took my intestines out. Mm. Uh, Doctor Machado put drugs into me. Took your intestines out? Well, they didn't take any. They took my lymph nodes lymph out, nodes. but they they oh, really yeah, yeah. scooped around in there. Oh. And they were like, here, you guys want to see my scar? Do it. Oh, what? what? It was crazy looking. Oh. I don't know how I got and these now, like and now I can't come. That scarred me, so nothing comes out of my dick. Yep, I can tell you firsthand. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I just go. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> Fucking dust. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we are friends in real life. We do mm. like each other. Yeah, I'd say we love each other. Yeah, me and Jake edited a lot together, and and Christoph hasn't been here, but I've been calling him every day, being like, "I miss you so much, baby. <laughs> I'll be there soon. I love you." Yeah, we'll be in the same city soon, my dear. Yeah, yeah but we I... have an old podcast together. If you want some riffs, yeah, we have old riffs, Jean Jacks. Yeah, man, we just, we all met through stand up. Yeah, yeah. That's simple. I met yeah. you guys on the, at the same day because you guys. Were, oh really? Uh, it was my at first. Aud- at Austin's, yeah, Austin's, at Austin's it, Coffee first, in Winnipeg. My, I met like, him at Austin's too. Third time oh. in Orlando. I was the 19 years old. I had blonde hair, and I went. Oh, yeah. Let me invade this conversation with all these people that will be successful later. A lot of them were. Ben, Mark Agnon ben, ben Buenod was, was, was there too. Ben Buenod, was Mark Agnon, ben, Mark, Jeff Yumi. White was probably there. Yeah. He's on the TV now. Mm-hmm. You're a lot of people do a lot of big things out of Orlando. What? You have a hundred thousand followers on Instagram. Do, Jake no has four hundred thousand subscribers. I gotta, I gotta pull my weight around. I gotta get yeah, that number up, really dude. Kind of lacking, but it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you met um. And then yeah. we became best friends. And then we all became best friends. And then we, yeah. And then we, we started Made making. Love. We ske- shot like fifty sketches together too. Uh, yeah, yeah, pandemic it was time. We were going, We were hanging out all the time. Yeah, I remember the first sketch we made together on. This is back when your IG. I remember. I think it had like three hundred yeah, followers. Yeah, nothing. Mm-hmm. This is this is twenty nineteen or t- about to be twenty twenty. Yeah. Right, and it's no, no, no. It was because it was the pandemic was becoming. Th- we literally like we became together. actual friends. Yeah, during because the pandemic that was when we went to get chinese food on like the day trump announced yeah like it's really bad (laughs) yeah we went and got fucking groceries and shit together yeah because before then we we just did stand up together it was it was right at the point of because you're like a year ahead of me in stand up yeah but you were like clearly like way funnier than me and it was like i we weren't really tight because i wasn't i just wasn't good yet we didn't really be on shows together yeah and then we started making show uh, be on shows and then i was making sketches yeah came over and we just started like we need to try to film shit yeah we need to make stuff and yeah then and we had already been making i think our my memory is uh christoph was really gay about covid for a while which nope. is fair because very that's true. what you're supposed to Not do true. it's but, the most true thing you've ever said no i remember a big conversation <laughs> we had early was Cause we we had hung out a lot. Scared. We had hung out a lot doing uh, stand up, and then I think we did one podcast together in my old place. And then, yeah, that was fun. But we weren't really like super tight yet. But yeah. uh, the um, then you you wanted to you gave me a DMT pen. 
Yeah. And you brought, yeah, it, yeah, you brought yeah, it to yeah, my yeah. house, but you didn't want to go inside because of COVID. So we walked around the, the, uh, apartment, the complex. apartment complex and talked about life. And yeah. uh, the DMT's crazy. But the, yeah, that um, shit was wild, bro. I saw the aliens. Yeah, I saw the aliens and <laughs> I shit. I saw the aliens. But then we started making sketches after that because you were really jealous about everyone doing, doing, well. get, doing really well. Yeah, I so you're like, I gotta go to shit. therapy. Yeah. Like, they get, they're doing better than me. Yeah. That happened to me too. Yeah. I didn't go to therapy, but I was, um, <laughs> I'm not bitch. a pussy. Yeah. But, <laughs> but, but I watched, like, because I watched Jeff blow up. Yeah. I watched Ben start blowing up. Heather was blowing up. Yeah. And before, as much as I try not to have the mindset of, like, oh, you need to know somebody, that, that even the little, any inkling of that just went away. Yeah. I was just like, you oh, they're just yourself. doing shit. I yeah. remember I literally did not sleep this one night and nonstop was like, what am I? fucking doing wrong yeah and i just took all my much? shit and just yeah. simplified as much right. as i you can. just threw away all the cheeseburgers and the, <laughs> yeah. the ice cream yeah. <laughs> what am i doing wrong <laughs> what am I, doing I know wrong? i'm not doing enough online content <laughs> no, I, I, no yeah. I just I, I looked at my shit from a real from as if it wasn't me making it yeah objective i was just like why is this not working yeah oh, they don't fucking understand it none yeah. of this makes sense and you have a really good understanding i guess that you've developed after that that of like what's gonna do well online yeah, yeah. Dude, I made dog shit before I started going viral. It was yeah. bad. I mean, even Everybody in Get Good Episode that, 1, man. the stuff that blew up was pretty much just you. Or, like, your ideas. Like, yeah. I didn't come up with the interview. You wanted to do that. That was a straight improv. Yeah. You, you didn't even man. want You literally well, I don't wanted want to, to do it because, yeah, we were, like, short, we were like, let's move on. That. But then it ended up being the, the big thing. And, then yeah, the, and it's just also, like, I think just that idea... W- with you and Dean in the scene together, it's like just you and Dean being in a scene is just kind of like it's a recipe for something funny. Yeah, that's why, yeah. and that was a cool part about getting episode one, doing that separate from the other ones, is being able to be like, all right, what works about this? And yeah, we'll what just do, do we more of that? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. more Dean, who's not even going to be a character, and then yeah, more uh, fucking, more Kristoff. Yeah, more more Christoph, like more dragon, more Kristoff being funny, more Kristoff being handsome. Yeah, but no, yeah, I th- <laughs> <laughs> exactly, exactly. But I, I didn't, uh, I didn't have that same realization because I was, I think, even to this day, there's a mentality of like, I'm here for the, I'm here for the ride. Yeah, I like chilling. And then yeah. you're like, and literally throughout my entire, I think, content, every, anything I made except for like stand up clips, is uh, somebody going like, Hey, you want to, you want to help out with this thing? You want to make this thing with me? And I'm like, All right, yeah, I'll, sure. I'll vibe. Yeah, yeah you got, yeah. you got drinks. <laughs> then, uh, you got games on it. Yeah, because well, you, you, I think needed my help for the sketches just yeah. to have somebody to bounce off of. I think, I, I think I was, in, I think I was. I mean, you've made the ones alone. I mean, like, I'm just like, I can't do. It. I don't know. It's and just riffing kind of, with you was really fun. The first yeah. ones we made were so gay. They were not, gay, not like a, in a cringe way. Literally gay. We were like, what if we like, were gay? What if we had sex? Okay, but what if it's 9/11 and we have sex? Yeah. There's a lot of the bits. <laughs> yeah, yeah. My alone ones do better than aside from get good, do better than all my other things. Yeah. But it's not as much fun. Yeah. Like you were there. My most successful thing I've ever done, as far as like repeating sketch wise, yeah. is the fucking floor waxer guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. were there when I filmed the first one. Yeah, yeah. I remember. I remember you helped me with the cameras. Like, am I am I in frame? Then I'm like, <laughs> yeah. trust me, this I look like a dipshit right now. <laughs> just, just trust me, it's gonna yeah, be good. It's gonna work. So yeah. then you, yeah, so we were filming those together. Uh, at my old apartment, and then you went over to Jake's house to film that doctor sketch. Yeah, and I wasn't even. In, I was just like, "What are you doing today? You want to film?" And you were like, "I'm gonna film this thing at Jake's." Yeah, and it was by. like, and yeah, you were like, "Come by if you want." And I came over, and I think we also filmed the Borat sketch, yeah, yeah. which was oh, our wow. first taste of like something yeah, being something good because we didn't. We had like 20,000 on something before that. And then that one got like 500. That one got on like TikTok. eventually. But then I remember the next day it blowing up and no feeling of something blowing up has ever been nah, that good. like that. First yeah. Time. We were it's texting like each other hit. like, holy shit, bro. Dude, everybody knows us. Dude, I fucking <laughs> remember showing my roommates that sketch and them going like, oof, like uh, that's cringe. cringe. Yeah. And then me like feeling so defeated. And then that blowing up and me going like, Told you, motherfuckers. Fuck them, dude. <laughs> yeah. Told yeah. you, bitch ass. Yeah. Was that your? Was that our first time like making something together? That was the first time in that apartment. Yeah, and then from then yeah. on, we or in that house, and then from then on, we made everything at that house, and then he moved here, and we started making everything here. Yeah. Nice, dude. My coworker was like, my friend sent me a video of you. I got a couple of those. I felt good. My cousin was like, dude, good, dude, I saw you. Getting like, shared like organically is fun. Yeah. No. Like, your cousin's like my friend. But then now that we all have like you know. Decent little decent, following. Decent following. Like back then, it was a lot different, man. Like now, it's like you have Instagram Reels, YouTube Shorts, all these things. Like and mm-hmm. like everyone knows that's the game, you know. Yeah. Back we were kind of early adopters, especially Jake, especially a lot of people in Orlando. I think. Well, I remember I when you, your stuff started doing good on Heather Reels. Heather and me all immediately took to TikTok. Yeah. 
and Sean. I remember the, oh, fucking Philippe blew the Philippe fuck up too. had like almost a million subs at some point on TikTok. Yeah, I think when you started doing Instagram reels mm. was of stand up. Yeah, and I think I had the thought of like I have some videos I could edit into that, but I was just so lazy mm. to do anything for myself. Mm -hmm. And then I think I was, dude, this was during chemo. I think I was bald when I was uploading them, but mm. I was started editing. Uh, like that clips. was a big thing is yeah putting my own stand up clips on there and yeah. yeah and not taking a while before the first thing like I think like the third video had like a million that was the poetry one mm -hmm. and everybody and then I had a <laughs> I had like a huge surgery and I go on her and I wake up and I pull out my phone notifications like this is ruining comedy. Cool. I hope one of your balls falls <laughs> off. Can I hit that? I, mean, I miss the editing sessions of. We weren't even editing the same thing. Yeah. You, Christoph, would be in my kitchen table. I'd be in my room. Yeah. And you'd be like, Jake. <laughs> and be like, yeah. And vice versa. I'd be like, is this stupid? Yeah. <laughs> like, having show each other stuff. And you also knew more about Premiere and just would help me learn Premiere. Yeah, but it's just having that, like, no, I don't want to say accountability, buddy, but it's like, oh, yeah, he's coming over to edit. And we're we're, we're, we're getting we're shit yeah. done today. Yeah, like, that, we fucking, for a full year, it was just like, we're editing shit like every yeah. day together. Yeah. And we just, everyone just blew up from it because it was just this cohesive of environment of like people who actually gave a fuck and were like trying hard and yeah. yeah and taking like, all right, that didn't work. Why didn't it work? Taking it serious. Yeah. You know, yeah. no, cool. for sure. Yeah. No, I definitely, uh, you guys have been instrumental in anything I do, but I don't even think about it like that. In turn, it's like to me, it's all felt very natural. The progression. I do think about I'd, it that way as, you know, yeah. you kind of owe everything to me, but yeah, go on. No, I owe everything to Jake as far Actually, as... Actually, I, I owe everything to Jake, and Jake owes everything to me, so therefore, by the law of transactions, I owe... It's just us on both of his tits. <laughs> yeah, e equals MC squared. Nipples, so. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, pretty much. I mean, you were taking stuff serious, and then I was like, well, Jake's funny, and he'll help me. <laughs> yeah. Well, I just liked vibing. I mean, a lot of those making the sketches were just fun, and it gave us an excuse to hang out, and yeah. I mean, that's where we become bros. Yeah. You know, it's just being around each other for like three days a week to like yeah. we used to edit together too yeah. and uh and yeah i think that's where we really came boys was through making shit together yeah for sure and then go, it was making a sketch and then going to the mic mm -hmm. and talking about our fucking gay feelings, our gay feelings. Yeah. <laughs> that's our favorite <laughs> thing to do is talk about our gay feelings like film a me. show yeah. like do a show together come home with the footage and just start chopping it up immediately. yeah yeah, yeah. and be like I gotta be better it. i gotta start posting stand up again. be like two three mm -hmm. eight, i have like, a bunch of stuff i just haven't posted it there's multiple yeah. days where it was like dude i'm f i'm just gonna sleep here <laughs> <laughs> you like crash on the couch because yeah, it was already yeah, like would. three or four yeah i done the other once at your place yeah. from i didn't get get good the the actual like assembly of it yeah was like every day that was like a full-time job for me i'm just going to your place like right. around two every day and editing to like you know, fucking the, the, this. That's the one thing I learned a lot on because remember, I we we shot out of order. Yeah. So I'm having I have like a folder of like Monday, um, March third. You know, yeah. and I'm having a, I organize everything and I gave like a full skeleton to every single episode, and I spent fucking hundreds of hours doing that. Yeah. yeah. Literally, and then you had to still come in and go. All right, now I have to fucking throw that much time into this and yeah, really refine it. Yeah, it was it. a lot. And then, well, and it also worked out because you would be at work and I would just edit while you're in the other room at work. Yeah. And then, uh, but it was a lot of, and there were certain scenes that I didn't touch at all. Like most of the comedy stuff you pretty much nailed. But then there were certain scenes that were like just Joe dialogue things that I was like, this has to sound like natural. And that yeah. took so much tweaking. Yeah. Getting the car conversation to sound like a real conversation, oh, getting the argument to sound like a real conversation. Was really, really good. What the car? Yeah, Joe. I thought that it was yeah. great. Yeah, no, no, I, I wasn't saying. Oh man, as far as like fucking Joe, it's just I'm just remembering the process. Like yeah. all the stuff. The one thing I'm really I know this is why I know it's going to do at least as good as the first step. Yeah, is I've seen these apps a hundred times, and yeah. there's still scenes that get me. Yeah, yeah. I think like, a right, huge a part of editing bit. too, and there's even some things in episode one that is still are like, eh. But then the main thing to remember as far as cutting stuff is like this. If anything even gives us a little bit of pause, like we go, eh, I don't know about that. Just take it out. Yeah. And I think that you it's do you ha have to have a sense it's, of uh, like really I, we need to get it, get so rid tight. of anything. It's like even bits that we like riff for like an hour. It's like, cut, you know, just use a second of yeah, it. Use the one cutaway. Yeah. yeah. No, I think uh, I think we had a good little editing process. And yeah. Then, yeah. This next time the assembly is going to be better and we'll hopefully have more hands. Mm -hmm. to do yeah things. you want to do season two we should yeah that'd be lit 
Uh, we have ideas for season two for sure. Yeah, I mean, I think we set I it up pretty idea. well to, yeah. Yep. Me, main character. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you are for episode four. <laughs> <laughs> but the whole time. You're definitely, there's going to be another Arden Kristoff episode. And Jake is on stilts. Yeah. What? He's really tall, and we don't, and Jake, he had a growth spurt. Mm-hmm. You guys hate my ideas. Yeah. <laughs> you guys hate my fucking ideas. Yeah. I come fucking to you with, I'm invited It's supposed you. to be an open dialogue, you know? It's supposed to be a safe space. You can close it. I'm fine with that. No, yeah, I guess there's nothing. We I also like reminiscing, catching up on on the story of yeah, of how we got lore. Yeah, on, the, on all the lore. Yeah. Is there anything? Is anything, anything else you got that you, you want to tell the audience? Dude, just fucking enjoy Get Good, man. Yeah, watch the show, dude. Like mm-hmm. shit's lit. AF. Sit back and enjoy the show. Like I think it's it's really fucking cool, man. It's really good. Obviously, we made it, so I'm biased, but yeah. It's. I, I really think people are gonna be happy with it. No, I mean watching it back. I hadn't seen it all done, and even though it's not, I mean it's not a hundred percent. There's still like little tweaks or whatever. But yeah, for ep four and five, for we have to the tweak, last but two episodes. But we have a month to do it. Still. That being said, I'm. It's very, very. It's just good. It's just impressive and funny. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, let's do it. Let's make it's a exciting. movie. Yeah, let's make a that's movie. Good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I'm. I'm make excited. a movie. All right. Yeah, that's all I got. I, I got a fart going, but I think if I do, I might shit myself. Yeah. <laughs> I got to pee really it's a good bad. Way to end it. Yeah. <laughs> Let's call it there. No, no, no. no, no, no. Shit yourself. Yeah, right shit now. yourself on the pod. Right now. There we go. And we do can make it, the title it, like. It. Oh, no. Oh! oh! <laughs> Should have pulled the mic down, oh. dude. No, cut that actually. Maybe I don't want. I think I actually did, guys. Cut that. 